Hey, welcome to Electric Thrust. The shop around here has been buzzing lately. We've got all kinds of projects we've been working on. And the main one right here, we're trying to get ready for a show. We've got a show in about two weeks that we're trying to get ready for. We're gonna take the uh, A1 Attack, the boat, Mini Cooper, Tesla, and maybe something else special. So the K1 Attack, when we got this baby in, didn't have an interior, so I've been working on getting that all in. Put in these leather dash panels, glove box, center carbon fiber console, carbon fiber steering wheel here, and carpet in the floors. This thing is looking super sweet. Now it's not gonna be running yet. We're still waiting for batteries to put in the battery pack. But other than that, this car is about ready to hit the road. So now, let's go check out another project. Okay, so the next project we're working on is the Mini Cooper. Now you guys have seen uh, a lot of footage on this already. Right now we're doing a dry fit. We've got pretty much everything in here. Uh, so we've got our valence batteries. We've got five batteries up front underneath the hood. We've got our Curtis controller. Down here we've got the AC50 motor made it up to the transmission that came in the vehicle. All right, and if you want to follow me, I got a nice little touch for you. Earl the painter has been putting a little something, something special in the car. We've taken all the silver body panels out of this thing and painted them electric thrust orange, and this thing is looking good. All right, now to give you a little update on the 33 Ford Hot Rod project. And for those of you who don't know, this is going to be the fastest electric car on the road. All right, we got our new Rush Forth wheels on. We got suspension done, steering, brakes interior body panels, and a racing rear end in this thing. So this thing is a roller at this point and about ready to hit the road. Now, what we're going to do here is we're going to install a motor right here in the transmission tunnel. This will be a direct drive all the way to the back. Then right in here in this area we're going to put the battery pack, controller, and all the electronics. 